everyone. I wanted to give you a little video preview of where you'd be able to locate this information that you're requested to find. So I like Morningstar. It seems to show me everything I need in a very usable format. So what you want to do is you can kind of, if you want to look up Home Depot, start typing in the name and then you can find it. I'm going to use a company called LPS, Lender Processing Services. My neighbor actually works for them. And they're headquartered here out of Jacksonville. So when it comes up, you can see their stock symbol. You can also see the um, stock price, and you'll see a little graph down here of what's happened to the stock price. And you can review that in more detail if you'd like. Then you'll see up here we have key ratios and financials. So I'm just going to scroll down and show you some of the other information you'll find. So you can see dividends, what dividends have been paid lately. You can see what industry they're in. You can see their key stats, which is what we're really going to key in on right now their competition, um, abbreviated financials. So let's scroll back up. You can also access their actual financial statements rather easily as well. So let's scroll back up and look at key stats here. We're going to click on more. And it's taking us to that key ratios page. You could also click on that to go there directly. So I've asked you to find a few key pieces of information. First one is revenue. And again, pay attention to the dates up here because the latest is furthest out. Um, gross margin ratio, I ask you to find. Earnings per share, let's see, that's given to us. So you need to do that. Return on equity, let's see, that's down here towards the bottom. Current ratio, okay, you can see here there's even more ratios. Financial health, cash flow, growth. So you can click through those and take a look. Current ratio happens to be under financial health. Um, but I think price to earnings and dividend yield you will have to calculate yourself using the formula in the book. You may be able to find it here. I'm not exactly sure where to look. Dividend payout ratio, that's given to us up here. Uh, total asset turnover is an efficiency ratio. And debt to equity will be another financial health ratio that you'll want to look at debt to equity is down here at the bottom. Now I also asked you to find revenues and um, net income. Well that you see revenues but net income isn't given here. Oh I guess it is down here. But then um, I asked you to locate some information about the statement of cash flow. So if you click on the tab that says financials here it'll bring you to the income statement balance sheet and cash flow uh, summary. So go ahead and click over. You can Review the revenue and net income for the income statement or any balance sheet item for that matter. And you can also review the cash flows. And I asked you to pick out the most significant source of cash from operating, investing, and financing activities. So you can see here we have our operating activities, investing activities, and our financing activities. So again, these are sources and uses of cash. The positives will be sources. The negatives will be uses so you'll have to scroll through and see which is their best um, source of cash here for them it looks like depreciation and amortization which is actually a non-cash expense that gets added back so net income would be their best source of cash and do the same thing for your investing and financing activities some of them may be um, uses of cash and you can see that here so if you have any questions, please let me know. I hope that helps. Thank you.